can't park a cheater down here. Somebody's parked in a handicap, and uh, they, this property's called it in the game. We got a 3500 Ram parked out in front of this building in the handicap spot right over there behind those trees. You can see it right over there. The big, it's got big pipes on it. It's gonna, not going to be an easy load. It's got extra uh, wide wheels. Wow. Go ahead and get a hook on it first. Check this truck for damages. Twenty three tags are good on it. Good. Got Anyway, this truck's uh, unlocked. I, I looked inside to see if I could find a, a, a handicap placard, and I don't, I don't see one anywhere. Uh, but it's a nice truck, man. It's a, it's, it's an older model. I think it's Callaway's. I think Callaway might be the, uh, the name of the company that put it together. I don't know. It's a custom something or other. I don't know. Either way, it's a nice truck. But he got caught parked in a handicap spot. Uh, what he should have done is put it in, in another space. I built this channel up by towing handicapped spots. I don't get to tow near as many as I would like. But people got to call them in in order for me to tow them. So anybody in uh, Atlanta area, man, if you're an apartment property... Call them handicapped cheaters in, man. Well, let your tow company come over there and get them. Well, we will get them. Promise you that. The Mustang over here at this building here. There's a guy parked over there by it in a, in a white van. I'm not sure what the guy in the white van's doing, if he's just hanging out in the shade eating his lunch. 
and I've got to tow that car right beside him. Uh, it may be his car. We're going to back over there and uh, try to hook that car, see what happens. Company that's taking it out. Well, the manager called it in to tow. Yeah, uh, I know. The manager up here. Him. Yeah. Uh, I have, uh, what? A different company is coming for it. What, what did she? Uh, what did the manager tell you? She says that uh, to to let you know that um that I'm gonna take it out from here. Okay. Uh, so originally I had it over there, but she said uh to move it and stuff like that, and yeah. um, to make sure that yeah, you, you came. You pumped the tires up already, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. Okay, I don't know. I mean, it uh, turns on and everything like that. I, I'm just yeah. going to move it somewhere else to like uh, okay. well, um, storage and everything like that. Uh, well, I'll call my dispatch. I mean, obviously, the tires are pumped up, tags on it, yeah, all that. I mean, it looks, I and, yeah. It too, so it's not okay, like, uh, uh, I'll call about. my dispatch and tell her that it, it's, it, it, I mean, you're going to have to get it moved, though. She's going to yeah, tow no, it. No, I already called You got her somebody and, coming uh, now? Yeah, I, ca I called Okay, uh, if, if you got a tow company coming now, she's probably, because what will happen if I leave here and she still wants it gone, uh, what what will happen you'll leave and, and she'll call us back over here okay. if you've got somebody yeah you got somebody coming that's fine yeah okay have a good one man yeah, i already caught her too either way yeah let her I know i mean but i would wait here to make sure they move because yeah, for the same reason yeah. i stay yeah. here yeah. Uh, i knew that if i tried to explain my phone yeah i called her and she was like oh you know it's fine but at the same yeah. time if they come for it they come for it yeah yeah so that's anyway, why i was yeah. like you got it I, thanks man stay wait. yeah have a good one sir yep it's a very good possibility that he's uh and he no longer lives on this property and his car is still over here or something like that it's got a good tag uh, the tires are pumped up and she's still towing it or told him it didn't matter uh, there's a reason though that she's towing it we don't know what the reason is but she's got a valid reason to tow it or she wouldn't be towing it uh, anyway it is what it is I'll call a dispatch and let her know at GOA uh, but I think that gentleman is smart enough to know that if he leaves here uh, and she calls back in to tow that car and we get here before he does, he's going to get towed. We're rolling to the next. i got to call dispatch, man. Y'all stay tuned. we got something else that's going to pop off. It always does. We're rolling in on a, uh, another impound, y'all. This uh, our just manager right here. She's uh, she don't play around about her property. Anyway, we got a Benz behind us. A Benz is in that fire lane. There's a there's a mother and a, a kid, a little daughter sitting on the curb. I, I'm gonna have to back up right where they're at to load this car. But either way, we're gonna hook it and see what happens. saying earlier this manager she don't play around about her fire lanes man and no parking zones uh, she keeps this property clear for school buses fedex delivery people uh amazon these big trucks coming here and they can't they can't maneuver around with people parking the fire lanes so they get towed man it's just and either even and, and if uh, there is a fire she don't have to worry about it uh, but she's had a lot of pressure on her over the years um 
from uh, code enforcement about her fire lanes. That's why she told she's not gonna hear anybody calling her about her fire lanes. She don't she don't play it. Uh, this channel really needs to be uh, needs to be recategorized as an educational channel. Uh, we teach people how to park. <laughs>